Hello. Okay. Hello, everybody. Okay, let me know. You know, I need y'all to let me know. Y'all can see me and hear me well, okay? Because I am a little farther back from the, the speaker. So, today is the fun day. We're going to be creating vision boards. Today. So we're gonna be creating vision boards today. Um, I'm not gonna be taking up too much of y'all's time. You know how I do, maybe just about 20 to 30 minutes. Okay, so I know that we're probably not gonna finish it today. So um, I'm just gonna let y'all know what y'all need to do so that y'all can finish it yourself. So of course we are here in my fabulous spa. Okay, that God has blessed me with. I'm so grateful. Um, Cause this was a vision. This was just a vision that manifested into um, something in person. Like, you know, it's just a vision. It started from a vision. Anybody on the live today? For the motivational topics, and this is just motivational topics from my point of view, okay? My mama was supposed to be with me today. She said that she was going to come, and it didn't work out. So that's not my fault. I know that y'all was looking forward to seeing her. But maybe next week. Maybe she'll be here next week. And um, I told y'all y'all can grab you a bottle of wine for today. I went and I got me a bottle of wine. And I realized, hold on one second, my screen looked blurry for some sad Okay. Yeah, so I thought I had a um a bottle opener here, but I don't. So I won't be having a glass of wine. <laughs> I have some later. We'll have some later. But yes, we're doing the vision board party today. Okay, I see that I have two two viewers. Okay, two viewers. I don't know who they are, but I see but now one. <laughs> they was hurry but jumped off. They didn't want me to know that I, I had a view. Okay. <laughs> but yes. So what is a vision board? No, actually, I wanted to tell y'all what we talked about last week first before we get into the vision board. Last week, we talked about goals and how it is so important to make goals, you know, set goals, put a timeline, you know, on what you need to do in between those goals and a date on when you want to accomplish your goals. So, could y'all hear me very well? I hope so. So... That's what it, um, goals is, you know, just first of all, getting our mind right to, to know the right goals that we, we didn't want to set. So, so, you know, we have to renew our mind in order to set good, productive goals. So we have been renewing our minds over the weeks. Um, that I've been talking to y'all. Hopefully, I hope y'all been renewing y'all minds and God been giving y'all ideas as to what he wants you to do in life. So, and then I hope you're writing them down again, putting a um, timeline on. So, a vision board is a collage of pictures, text, and other items that represent and affirm one's dreams and ambitions. Created to help visualize and focus on one or more specific aspirations. So that's what a vision board is, okay? <laughs> My heart fell off the wall. So that's what a vision board is, and that's just going to help you to um, to accomplish your goals a lot more easier, quickly, and efficiently. So I'm gonna let y'all take a look at my vision board. Um, so I created I create vision boards 
like all the time. So this is a vision board that I created a while back that I wanted to use as an example, because again, I know that we're not going to finish the vision boards today. So I'm just going to be working with y'all, you know, doing it together as a little, some fun. But I want to show you, this is how, this is my old vision board. Okay, I have a um, space for spiritual, my, my spiritual stuff is here. My career stuff and my uh, financial stuff is here. My family stuff is here. Uh -uh. My family is here, okay, and then my love, life, and stuff is here, okay. So I have goals. I have a lot of goals actually. So and I like I want to I like to travel. So you see, I put a lot of travel stuff on there and all that good stuff. So today we're gonna be creating a new vision board. So I don't know. If anybody got their stuff, but this is just a blank vision board that I'm going off of today. And also, I have my blue stick, my scissors, and I have some magazines. Oh, 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 big Oprah. Why not? So that's what we're going to be doing from today. And still, no comments. I just got a view. But y'all know how Facebook is. We don't we don't usually like stuff that's positive. So but I know that you guys will watch the video later. So so yes so i already cut out a few pictures and whoever's there you know go ahead and talk to me through the comments because this is not just from my point of view this is from our point of view from my point of view from your point of view okay from everybody's point of view so let me know what are some of y'all goals what are some of the things that you want <clears throat> to do in life what are some of the things that you want out of life I already cut out a few pictures. A few pictures. I still got to um, cut out more. So I have my magazine that I'm working from. And I'm just going to, we're going to create a vision board. For about, I'll be with you for about another few minutes. Um, I do 20 minutes today. So another 12 minutes I'll be here. And I'm just going to be cutting out pictures, showing you some stuff that um, that goes with my goals. I'm going to create my vision. And I'm going to wake up every morning to that vision. So one of my goals is to be married. So right now, I'm just looking in a magazine to find someone in here that, you know, well, a couple that looks happily married, like my old vision board. Let me go back to my old vision board and show y'all who I thought was a good couple. And I said, I love the way he loved her. You know, I don't want what they have at all. You know, I want my own type of love, you know, but. This was a perfect example. Kim and Kanye. Don't you just love how he loved her? I love how Kanye loved that girl. I heard they was getting a divorce, but that ain't none of my business. <laughs> so, so I'm just looking through my magazines. Where is everybody today? Y'all usually be litty lit lit in the comments on the side. I know that sometimes y'all don't be liking positive stuff, but dang, y'all just gonna say, no, nah, we ain't doing no vision board. We ain't finna tune in today. Cause I sure don't see no comments. But I ain't gonna worry about it. 
Because after I'm done, I'm going to have about 100 views. <laughs> but no likes and no comments. I'm here, guys. Talk to me. What are some of y'all goals and dreams? Okay, so I think I cut everything that I need out of this magazine. So I'm going to look at another magazine. And let's go ahead and talk a little bit more about um, goals. Let's see. So last week we talked about how we want to live. How are you living now? And what changes do you need to make to li live the life that you want to live? Ooh, those cookies look so good. Yeah, so that comes with everything starts with changing the people you're around, changing your thoughts, and all that good stuff. So that you can have a clearer vision of where you want to be. But sometimes we don't have no idea where we came from or where we going. Oh, that's a nice picture. So here's a nice picture, something that I like to put on mine because I aspire to have a, a 10,000 square foot house one day. And I think that these stairs are really beautiful right here. My stairs are pretty. I'm going to put that to the side. Yeah. So, here's another good picture. I love to do yoga. And here's a few yoga moves, but yeah, they have an animal up there on them, but that's a good picture to put on my vision board that I, you know, continue to do yoga and do more yoga. Because yoga is a, a good exercise. Oh my goodness. It, it helps stretches your bone, your arm. It helps, it's for a good stretch and flex, it's good for flexibility, flexibility, and um, it helps with your breathing. It helps you to get aligned with yourself. Um, understanding um, where we want to go in life. I hope y'all creating y'all boards. It's a little boring with nobody on here. Like sometimes if I could at least see the viewers up there, I can, you know, get a little excited and it makes me want to talk more. So sometimes just do videos and maybe just post the videos or something like that. But they still looking for pictures. And or texts. Oh, this is a good picture because I do eyebrows and um lashes and stuff like that. I think that this would be a good picture to put on my vision board just so that I keep that in my goals, keep that in mind. That eyebrows is very set. So I might use that picture. So if you're just now joining me, I'm having a vision board party, and I'm just right now going through magazines and finding pictures. I did show my old vision board. Let me grab it. It fell. Oh, this is my old vision board. I brought it just for example because I know that I'm not. We're not going to finish our vision boards today. So, I was saying that I have goals for spiritual. I have spiritual goals here. I have my career and financial goals here. I have my family goals and my love goals down here. Okay. So, just I'm just creating a new go um a new vision board um some of my goals that I haven't accomplished, of course, is still the same, and I have some new goals, too. So, 
I just want a new vision. You know, I ha I've had that vision board for the last past. Ooh. My over three years. So it's time for me to put that one up and start on a new one. Start on a new one. And I should have got better. Um, oh, that's a good um, picture. I should have got um, some new magazines. These are the magazines that come from the salon. You know, the O. You don't have a lot of good, good pictures in here. It's a lot of good content in here, but I love the good. Yeah. I ain't going to show y'all this picture. <laughs> <sighs> that I just found that I'm gonna use. What else? So we talked about paradigm shifts a few weeks ago. Ooh, that's a good text right here. I'm gonna take this for a gorgeous future. So, yeah, you can put text on your um, vision board, words, and stuff like that. So, I'm going to take those words. Yeah, so, like I was saying, like, um, sometimes, you know, we have to change our whole way of thinking in order to even think about something positive as, as far as goals to do. Like, because some of us come from, you know, from nothing some of us come from nothing and we had nothing positive to think about you know um never thought about creating goals and stuff like that so that's when we have to completely change our mind and I know that that's easier said than done that takes it's, it's a, a everyday process but everything start with renewing the mind and if you don't already have goals, if you feel like I can't see where I'm going or what I want out of life, you know, I suggest that you get into a place that is quiet, you know, on purpose, you know, talk to God and ask him what it is you want to do. <laughs> Jean has joined me. I can always count on Jean. That color lipstick you rocking is on you, queen. Thank you, Jean. I appreciate that. I like the red lipstick, too. I was like, um, when it started getting cold outside, I wanted to, you know, spice it up with a little red. But thank you, Jean. You got your stuff on your vision board? You created, you created your vision board? Well, if not, you can always get your stuff and do it on a later date. You can always do that. So, um, the truth is clear. Here's another text that I found that I might use. It says, the truth is clear. So I'm going to use that as a picture. And Jean, not yet. Life been busy. I know that's right. It has been for me too. Oh, it has been. And like I said last week, ever since I started trying to come over here and do something positive, life has got a little bit more busier. Today was hectic again. But here's a, um, you get around to it. But here's a copy of my old vision board, Jane. I just wanted to show, you know, some of my dreams and visions. I have my spiritual part here, and then I have my career and my finances here. I have my love, um, and my family. My family is here, and then my love life down here. So that's just a little glimpse of my vision board. Oops. I don't want to tear it up because I want to keep it. I'm going to put it up in a nice place. But, Jane, trust me, I know life is busy. But you will be in my vision board. 
<laughs> you said I will be in your vision board. You're so crazy. <laughs> Do not put me in your vision board. I'm trying to work on something right now. I'm trying to trying to I think I found the person that's going to be in my vision board. <laughs> so I don't need no confusion. Don't put me on your vision board. But thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I love it. Yeah, so I've been here for about 20 minutes now. Okay, so now what I'm going to start doing is I don't have all my pictures, but <laughs> but I'm going to um, start doing some pictures on my vision board. Oh, should I do this? But but those. <laughs> No, I'm not going to put that on my vision board, that lady. Okay, so this is what I'm talking about, like some stuff like this. Oh, isn't this beautiful? Wouldn't you love to store your dishes and your stuff like on something like that? That's pretty. I just aspire to have a, I want a big, beautiful home. Um, that's what's going on my vision board. I'm gonna put a 10,000 square foot home on my vision board. Um, I'm gonna put my business still prospering. Uh, I would like to have another business, multiple businesses. I want to put all of that on my vision board. But most of all, I'm gonna put stuff stuff that I want to accomplish within the next five years on my vision board. So. That's what I'm going to do. Congratulations on what, Jane? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yeah. And then, you know, you can put your dream car on your own um, vision board. I have actually a picture of my dream car that I want to get printed out. I didn't have time to get it printed out, but I want to get it printed out and put on my vision board. I um I have a picture of it. I've been dreaming about that car for a long time. Well actually I have two cars that I've been dreaming about for a long time. But um yeah so this is going to conclude our vision board party. Um I hope that you all take out the time to first get the things that you need, um, the vision board, the glue, the scissors, the pictures. That's all you need. And then you're going to create something so nice like this. I would have stayed longer um, if my mom was here because it's just like it don't make no sense for me to be sitting here for that long, you know gluing all of my pictures and all of that stuff on you know we can do that on our own time but i just really want y'all to get an idea of what a vision board should look like okay so this is what your vision board should look like depending on what your creative um you you pull out your creative side this is what i use so again career and finances here Okay, I'm going to explain my vision for it a little bit while we're here. Okay, so it says at the top, it girl. You know, I've always been that girl, but I want to continue to be. Okay, so it girl, beauty, best salons at your fingertips. Okay, this was before I got my salon that I created this vision board. But I just knew that I wanted to have a salon and I wanted it to be popping. So I wanted it to be the best, okay? Um, I love fashion. So the world of fashion. And it says style. It's so you. And, okay, I put this picture of Kim Kardashian here just to, um, because I like Kim 
Kardashian. I like the way she dressed too. So I, I put this in place of myself. It's actually, I say it's me, okay? And it says here, Kim Kardashian wore Balenciaga November 20th. So when I look at the vision board, I say, Kelly Harden wore Balenciaga November 20th, okay? And I'm really getting into this stuff. Really, really is. Yeah, so um, I got a lady here. Eyebrows, eyebrows. That's what I do. That's what's going to be on my vision boards, okay? Um, I want to make a million dollars. I don't know if I if I made it, but I'm pretty sure I probably was close. Um, okay, life in the fab lane. Okay, style ethics. Okay, um, I'm all about fashion. I love fashion, so I put some things up here that I aspire to get. Kristen, Louis Vuitton, Rolex, Chanel, Balenciaga, Givenchy, best dress. Okay, I always want to be the best dress everywhere I go. I know that y'all probably think that this stuff is a little, you know, cliche, but this is from, this is far as like finances and um, career goals. This is where I want to be. Okay, so I always wanted to deliver babies. So one of my goals was to be a um, midwife. Because I love dealing with pregnant women. I love talking to pregnant women. I love, you know, just helping them out, pushing them towards a natural childbirth. And one day I'm going to go back to school and I'm going to be a nurse. And I'm going to deliver babies. Watch what I tell you. Okay, what else? So, yeah, you see, it's money all on mine. You know, I, I just, I want to get this money, okay? So, I would like to live in New York one day, okay? So, this was a text that I found. It says, two New York artists make their first foray into fashion or whatever. So, anything that had something to do with New York, I just put it down, you know. Um, New York City, opera. And then, this is my traveling stuff here. I got a little couple of places that I want to travel. I want to help people. So, this is a picture of Michelle Obama helping people. Uh-oh. My battery is going low. So that's a, just an example of my career goals and my financial goals. I'm going to go over one more, and I'm just going to talk about my spiritual goals, and then um, I'm going to close out. But as far as my spiritual goals, when I created this vision board, I said, you know, because I know that God lives. I believe in him 100%. I believe the Bible 100%. And that's that so i put here he lives okay celebrating the spirit okay um you're in good hands philosophy believe in miracles i believe in miracles and i re i get miracles all the time that come in my life like god is so mysterious i have this on here i found out how mysterious he is Crowning glory, I witness a miracle because I always, I just want to be in a place of miracles and blessings at all times. So, simple truth, connect with the joy of life every day. Here's a preacher man here preaching, where I see clearly now. Uh, miracle worker, he's unforgettable to me. I will make power moves and I will bounce back. Stress less, stress stinks, okay? So, that's just my spiritual part of my um vision board love your life okay so i have my love life and my family life down there but you guys can on your own time go ahead and create your vision boards so i just want to thank everybody that joined me here today and um post up some pictures in the comments to let me know you know how your vision boards turned out. I would love to see them. So I love y'all so much. And I will see y'all next week. Thank you for joining my live with my um, motivational topics from my point of view and from your point of view. This is